Hello, I'm Emma Green. I'm the Tennis Elbow Queen, and I'm going to talk about injections, specifically cortisone injections. So um, I got a message from somebody today who had said they have Tennis Elbow, they have just had a cortisone shot, and they're waiting for it to work. Good luck with that. Cortisone shots, cortisone shots, oh my goodness, cortisone shots. Well, um, the research is now showing us that cortisone shots are not the best course of action for tennis elbow. We've known this for quite a while, but it takes a little bit of time for it to trickle down into the medical community. Um, however, people are still getting them. People are getting a lot of cortisone shots. If you've had one, do not beat yourself up over it. It's one of those things, just don't have any more. Um, cortisone is a very strong anti-inflammatory and so the theory behind cortisone shots is that oh there's inflammation in the elbow let's reduce the inf inflammation and the elbow feels better so that was like what we used to think medical research has now shown that number one if you've had your tennis elbow for longer than like two or three weeks there's likely to be very few inflammatory cells actually in the tendon anyway um, so there's nothing for the cortisone to work on. Cortisone is strong anti-inflammatory. There's no inflammatory cells there. There's nothing for it to work on. The other thing that we know is that sticking needles into tendons, tendons don't like that. Tendon is actually detrimental to the tendon, no matter kind of what you're putting in there. But cortisone is like a double whammy because cortisone degrades soft tissue. It breaks soft tissue down. Tendon is a soft tissue. You're sticking something in there that's going to break that, that tissue down. That's not what we need. So... If somebody offers you a cortisone shot, don't have one. If you um, have had them though, like I think, don't beat yourself up is one of those things. Um, sometimes, or very often, cortisone will be mixed with a local anesthetic. So the local anesthetic goes in there and you feel this immediate relief because it's been numbed off. That's what the local anesthetic does. Um, once the local anesthetic wears off, you know, the cortisone, like I say, there's really not a lot for it to work on. So it's unlikely to help. What can you do instead? There are so many things you can do instead. Check out all my other videos. Start with phase one. Check out the, the phase one videos, then go through the phase two videos, the phase three videos, the phase four videos. You can take yourself through the four phases. If you need any assistance, don't hesitate to reach out. I'm more than happy to help you. And let's get your elbow healed the right way. Let's stop sticking it with injections. All right, I'll see you soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.